everybody, welcome to Mishmo 2554. Thursday brings an even more deliciously daring double set. It looks as though Kaiden and Moria have safely returned to my roster. Whatever war wounds they have suffered seems to have disappeared. Glad to see that, because their next challenge may wear them out again, as they'll have to tangle with their second batch of Tohos, Kenshi and Sirno. Unlike Raisin and Kamachi, these two have beaten the PPGs and have tremendous momentum in their court. If they can add the last players to their list, that could make them Hall of Fame bound in the very near future. Will K&M rise to the occasion and be the very first team to send K&C crashing on their face with an L on that pretty perfect record? We'll see as we haul rear down to a random stage. Hope you all enjoy. Buckle those safety belts. The holes in this road are going to be quite deep and could be hazardous for one team's health. This should be a spectacular super set between K&M, Kenshi, and Cyrano. Get ready and let's begin this blitz. Let's see who will get it started. All right, see Kenshi starts with a sword string, knocks Moria back right to Cyrano's energy beam, catches Kai. Now Moria throwing across the stage. Now oh my Moria attacking from behind. The left them an opening. That's bad. Now Kenshi gets a sword string going. Now Cyrano missed the aura burst. The K&M roll out of the corner, but Kenshi intercepts Kai. Moria hacking away at Cyrano. Now Cyrano unloading with an energy spare right there. Kenshi sword strikes. Good gravy. K&M nearly dead here. Kai and Moria trying to get their spacing game right again. Kenshi hacking away at Moria from behind. Kai trying to attack Kenshi from behind. Kai wasted. Now Cyrano unloads the energy beam. Now Moria trying to approach Kenshi who teleports out of the way. And now Moria getting pushed back by the energy sphere right to the energy beam from Cyrano. Now Kenshi summons a rainstorm. Now he ends up getting a jab lock on Kenshi from behind. But the lightning bolt wastes Moria out of the air. And Toho the second come back from behind nicely and take round one. Yowzers. Round two, let's see if K&M can make a comeback here. Come on, last fighters. All right, see Kai and Moria knocked out of the air. K&M rolling away. Now Kenshi unloads the rainstorm. Moria gets a jab from behind Kenshi. Right into Kai's double aerial sword strike. Now Cyril spaces with the energy orbs. Oh my goodness. Now Kenshi going to town on the last fighters. Big sword combo right to the lightning sword slam. Right into Cyril's energy beam. Let's see, now Misty Aura bursts from the air. Kai, K oh man, energy spear knocks Kai down. And oh my god, the bodies are flying. Kai spacing with the sword beams. And now Moria sandwiched. And Moria trying to fight back here. Kai gets him with the jump kick. Oh boy, they got the jab lock. Oh man, it was like Kenshi and Cyrano trying to fight out of it here. It was like Kenshi trying to get him buried. Oh my goodness, man, the Toho's really wanted. it. Let's see, now Cyrano and Lozu with the energy beam. K&M trying to roll towards him. Kenshi dead, oh boy. And now Cyrano goes with the energy sword, nearly takes K&M out. And now Kai gets a jab off right to the sword strike, into the lightning wall, waste Cyrano. And K&M barely scraping by round two. And they will push this epic superset into a round three. Let's blitz for the last time and see who takes it. All right, Moria teleports behind the girls. And see, oh my god, Kai jumping in with a kick right to the double aerial sword strike. And see Moria trying to catch him with another jab. Cyrano and Lotus with the energy spheres. Oh boy, Cyrano and Lotus with a big energy arm. Damn, looks like the k and managed to avert most of it. Now Kenshi hacking away at Moria. Cyrano and Lotus with the energy beam. Ends up blasting him good. Moria trying to catch Cyrano and she comes down. Oh boy, and now the lightning just juggling him all over the place. Yowza. And I see Kenshi, oh my god, Cyrano missed the fireball. And now Moria manages to take Cyrano out and Kenshi in deep trouble. And Kenshi off by the sword beam from behind. And the last bladers have done it, ladies and gents. They are the first ever to hand the defeat to Kenshi and Cyrano in doubles. 2-1. Holy hot poopykins. That was a crazy super set between these four. And the last players have a hell of an accolade to add to their resume, being the first to beat Kenshi and Cyrano. That's quite an accomplishment for K&M. Way to go, guys. And now they got some sweet momentum heading towards the 2590s, where it looks like they're going to fight the possessed J&W. So, <laughs> and that's going to be a hellacious set, let me tell you. And K&M, I hope they train a bit more off camera. They're going to need all the momentum they can get. I have a feeling J and W is a lot nastier now with whatever Z and Z pumped them full of. And Kenshi and Cyrano, no need to be disappointed here. I mean, yeah, they lost, but they had a very, very impressive performance against the, the last bladers. I mean, rarely anybody pushes K and M that hard. And already they're proving to be better than Raisin and Kamachi. It's only one major they lost here. I mean, they beat the PPGs a while ago, and now they dropped the K and M so they can rebound with another major real quick later. Still a great outing by those two, man. I am very impressed by them. I gotta clap all four combatants once again. Man, hell of a Thursday fight here. Loving it to death. 
Anyways, a great classic to lead us into tomorrow's set should be just as spectacular, I hope. And stay tuned, folks, for Musion Battle 2555. Coming soon. Laters all.